welcome back everybody to Farming Simulator 19 here on Spectacle Island 19. Your host with not the most, Mr. Blue, aka Tommy Miller. Folks, how y'all doing? My farmers doing all right out there? Oh, folks, I'm bringing this truck up here. We have the two green trailers up there, and as you can see, it's 109, well, 1,309 hours. I'm going to turn this off. But anyway, the, uh, as you can see, we well, can see the writing up there. It's still late autumn, same day as the last episode, but it's 1 o'clock in the evening in our moisture or wet coin symbol or wet crop symbol actually is gone. But we are still facing, and I'll show y'all here, tonight at midnight it's going to be raining. And Saturday has several, several different times in the day that it's going to be raining. And Sunday is snow. And Tuesday is snow. We got to get this corn out of the ground. And we got to get it out now. So we're going to be picking, harvesting, whatever you want to call it, the corn. Start this bad boy up. And uh, Dan from 3D Outdoors was saying fancy fold out corn head that I got here. Uh, yeah, it it's, uh, raises up, folds. Um, around my area in real life, we don't have too many of these. They all just a solid long head that goes on a trailer. And, uh, yeah, start this baby up. There we go. I'll lower the head down. And I think I was on that row. I hope. We're going to go right down this row. Hope I don't miss none. Should be about right if I can keep it straight. I can't really do that. But I'm doing now. Oh, I'm going to scoot up over over here. Oh, up here. I didn't count for two odd rows. But anyway, folks. Um, I am recording this on Tuesday... November the 30th. This is the last day of November. So, goodbye November and hello December. Um, you're, when you're watching this, it's going to be December the 3rd, which is a Friday. And um, just remember, today is uh, November the 30th, last day of November. I, Monday the 29th, I called Best Buy and say, look, my package is supposed to be here on the 22nd, or it's supposed to be shipped on the 22nd when the it was, release date was happening. And they're like, yeah, Mr. Miller, uh, there's been a delay. I'm like, yes, ma'am, i seen that. I said, can I check a couple of things out? They're like, what do you mean? I'm like, was there any problem on my credit card or anything? Because the shipping and the billing address is different. And she's like, let me check. And she said, no. She said, everything looks great on my end. And she explained to me what's going on on her end. They're supposed to get five pallets in of Farming Simulator 22 Collector's Edition. Five pallets, folks. That's a lot of games. But she said that they know for a fact it was shipped viral uh, uh, boats, you know, the shipping containers and stuff like that. Anything that was shipped by water has been delayed real, real bad. And I heard about it on the news and stuff, and, you know, everybody's getting a, a percentage of the troubles from it. But I just didn't think I would get it. <laughs> I hope I can make it down this end. No, I'm making a boo-boo. But anyway, she uh, told me, yeah, the shipping, you know, is delayed because of the shipyards and stuff. Can't get them unloaded. Uh, their shipment is supposed to get to them December the 3rd. I mean, December the 6th. So, my Farming Simulator 22 edition hopefully ships December the 6th to their stores 
and you know that's when they're supposed to get their package in that's when they're supposed to get their five pa pallets um so mine's coming from memphis uh which i'm our a north of there in arkansas so hopefully hopefully folks not too long after that I will have Farming Simulator 22. I don't think I'm going to be able to reach, so I'm just going to cut what I can off this end. I know we can't, don't need to because all the grass there. Whoa, I can't make it up the hill. Well, so much on that. Ain't got enough power to make it. Can I make it without cutting? I'm just going to shut the machine, the header off. I gave her a little bit more. But anyway, on uh, some news besides Farm Simulator, uh, some people across the tracks in, in town there, uh, if you're familiar with Luxor at all, there was a little bitty, little, little bitty hay field uh, <laughs> in town there. It, it's just right beside Delta Asphalt. Hey, our pipe will reach, good. Good. This is awesome. That means those two trailers down there, we don't need them to put corn in or we'll use the truck. Might pull up. But yeah, um, they're probably get about two bales of hay off this little field all together. If that, it's not very big. I mean, it's probably an acre of ground, maybe a little bit more. But uh, they have two molded hay bales that they're burning. And you're talking about something that stinks. All right, there we go. Fold the pipe back in. But yeah, they're burning that and it's starting to come towards my house. And it's the way the conditions of the weather is right now, it's kind of partly cloudy and cool and it's just like that stuff's just lingering in the air and it's just oh, talking about a nasty smell what about Scudo? I forgot about those two rows down here actually I think I'm going to get um I'm going to hire a worker for this when I get up here and because I got a couple other things got to do I need to get my tablet and What's going on here? Oh, I'm half, half of a row. Okay, there we go. So I was laying corn over. All right, hiring a worker. No, I don't want AI. Uh, I'm gonna turn AI worker off. Okay, hire. Oh. Whoa, you just, uh, 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 uh. He just made my tires run over a bunch of corn. I don't know why it does that when you hire a worker. Head pops up like that. Anyway, let's go in our menu here and see what we got. Um, yes, I got these two completed. Do that. We're going to go in here. We got 80000 Our loan's 140000 So we're going to repay some of that. Probably down about there. I don't want to go down too low because if we run out of money, the heifers quit. You going to be able to turn around all right? Oh, no, 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 no. You're not going to drive into corn. Actually, I probably need to do this. Let's just go ahead and do this. Um, Trying to think. Yeah, I'm beside the stinky hay bales. I'm doing our pretty all right. Um, the 29th, the Monday that evening, we had a uh, the Rivercrest game versus uh, Kip K I P P from Blavo, Arkansas, uh, come to our our town to play basketball. Uh, junior high uh, boys and girls. I don't know how they was playing boys against girls, but I think it's uh, the girls played first, and then the boys versus each other, uh, stuff like that. 
I don't know too much about it. I was outside mostly. Um, you know, just keeping an eye on the cars and stuff. I set my truck. And every once in a while, I started up and drive around. Just, you know, kind of like security in a way, but I, I just can't stand no more. Like I used to, so. Uh, I told the guys, the other guy that was helping me with security, I said, if you don't mind patrolling the inside, I'll take care of the outside and I'll just use my vehicle. But other than that, that's pretty much it, folks, for real life. Uh, I do, let's see, I'm going to set course speed here. And I'm going to try to pull up the comment on my other computer here, my old laggy computer. Uh, Ice Demon, or Ice Damon, I'm sorry if I'm butchering that. I still don't know how to pronounce it. Oh, come on, give me three mile an hour, really? Oh, we got to get a bigger and better combine, folks. Come on, a little bit more. You'll be out of it. There we go. Come on, come on. Shut it off. There we go. All right, turn back on. Whoa, slow down. Okay. All right, worker. Yes, I know you fool. That's why I wanted you to... Just, uh, Christy or Dan, whoever's doing it. Got a train coming through, folks, in real life. All right, I had to cut some of that out. That was just too loud. I know y'all probably didn't, wouldn't want it or anything, because it's a little loud. All right, you're going to sit there and unload. All right, while he's unloading, let's take a gander over here, because I ain't showed y'all the trees in a while, and, and this grass here is... It's bad, folks. We're going to have to come over here and spray it with fertilizer. Bar trees. They're probably a little bit taller, I think, the last time we looked. That's probably about right here. Of course, they're not going to grow much because we're not advancing time too much, but I can't wait to, for them to grow so we can cut them down. Anyway, get back over here. So who we got driving this? Oh, Christy, Christy, cough. All right, you go, girl. Let's see how much is in here. We got fifteen thousand and ninety liters, folks. This is going to take a while, so I will bring y'all back when the I guess this truck gets full or we get done with the field first. Um, what's going on here? I got my side panels out. Why? Oh yeah. Uh, oh, I can't. I can't think of the the new one's name. Uh, well, he, he's not new to us. He he he's been a while. A while. I just ain't brought him into the game. But uh, Tactic Gamer was helping me out, replacing some plow points and stuff. Uh, we'll probably get him to do some cultivating cul on this field. But uh, we got to do some more subbing over here. And let me look at this over here real quick. We got to do a lot of field work. They got it leveled, but it's not quite like I wanted. I thought I could get this to smooth off, taper some more, but it's just, it's hard to do. Just hard to do, folks. Oh, oh, fence, fence. But I done showed y'all this in the last episode, I think. But I just want to come back through here and give y'all a whirl. In case y'all missed it. But we repaired the fence. And uh, we put water in our greenhouses, which is 67%. I'll probably have to come around first thing in the morning or later tonight and refill these things. Uh, but, yeah, um... I think I pretty much got y'all caught up. We got this field here done. This need to be cultivated and probably fertilized some more. Here's a digestate slurry tankers and stuff, whatever you want to call them. But folks, I'm going to do a jump cut and bring y'all back when that trailer gets full or we get done with that land or something comes up. I'm going to uh, do some more contracts. 
uh, transport and gold mine. All right, I'll take that. Bakery. Um, bakery. Come on. There we go. Bakery to port side. We'll do it. We'll do it. I'm going to do these off screen while uh, Christy is over thrashing. And uh, I'll bring y'all back here in a minute. All right, folks. I ain't taking no chances. I'm going to refill this combine because it's out of fuel almost. I think I'm not in the right spot. Is that? Yeah, there we go. There we go. That didn't take long. We're almost done. And you're probably wondering why the tractors and trailers out of here. Our truck's almost full. And uh, we're moving right along. Um, it's 2.25 in the evening. Overlapping a little bit because he's got some down there that he missed. So, or, Sorry, sorry, sorry. That's Christy. All right, let's get back in here. Let's close these up. Move this bad boy out of the way. I guess I'm going to put it right over here. Hide it in the bushes. Um, update. Got the tractor plow out. Doing some plowing here. Um, as you can see right here, I'm using GPS. I straight shot down. Down this road right here. Up to here. And then, uh. Probably going to curve this a little bit. That, or I'm going to leave it straight. I don't know which one I'm going to do yet. Uh-oh. Got to get a combine. Got to get a combine. Oh. Start motor. Um, I usually been catching it on this end down here. Uh, unloading it. Come on, truck. Let's go. This truck needs some fuel, too. Catch a combine before it turns around. This is gonna be unrealistic. I can feel it. I can feel it. Don't, 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 no, 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 no. Oh, hold up, hold up. Wait. Oh, I'm pushing him now. There we go. Hey, I didn't say it would be uh, realistic. I said unrealistic. Especially when you do this. Give him just enough room to back up or. And we got 72,000 in here, and we can hold 98,670. So I'm going to keep on pushing on. Uh, you see me running the plow when I'm not doing the not doing the unloading of the combine. I'm trying to do some plowing, so got to get it done. Got to get it done. Now, did I knock them off course? I don't think so. Is he going to have enough power to make it? Probably not. Probably going to have to do the ends. But I will bring y'all back when we're done. Well, folks, this is going to be really, really close. The truck's, like, pretty much full. It's 97. It's 99% full, put it that way. It, it probably won't hold all this for sure. If it does, it's going to be a miracle. Or, or last of the corn. Or last crop. Yay. Let me turn around and make sure I didn't leave none. Nope. We're good, folks. We are good. I just hope the truck holds on. But not my auger. You can't see it with the... You have to lean forward to see it. Um, let's go ahead and fold up this header. Yeah, I do like the way it folds, but oh, I forgot I got to lower it down. If we don't lower it down, it'll go into the windshield. Did it? Did it? Oh, no, truck's full. And we got 106 liters left. Oh, good thing we got the trailers down here. I'll tell you what, we're just going to leave this in the combine and um, get Christy to drive this back to the farm shop. Um, I'm going to pick farm silo and hopefully we won't make a mistake. Where, where, where are you going? Where are you going? You got to go this way. 
Oh, don't hit the fence. That's my fault. I should have brought it out to the road better. All right. So 106 liters in the combine. And the truck has 98,670. So 98,771. If my math is correct. Oh, yeah, I know I need a tarp is start the motor um bring y'all right back um uh, with the plowing job show you what we got left probably going uh call it episode after that we'll get these dumped and uh be right back all right just in case some of y'all are curious well y'all know i can't drive ain't nothing curious about that but can we dump yes we can we can use auger to dump in. That's good. All right, I'll fold this bad boy up. Um, did I hit the right button? There we go. Now it's folded. I'm going to take it over here to the power washer because we need to wash it before we put it away. And, um, ooh, don't drive off in there. Ooh, we. We'll probably, uh, mm, that kind of hurt. Now we're going to dump this truck in there. And, uh, probably have to use the grain door. I don't know. I think we can use a big door. Shouldn't be nothing in the way right there. I just got to, oh. Got to back up over it some. Well, that, how about this trailer? All right, perfect. All right, just in case some of y'all saw some of that, I was flying my drone. Yeah, I'm still flying here. There we go. Getting here, we're almost done. I had to take a screenshot. We're dumping the corn into our silo, and let's go over here. Uh, we can hold, what is that, 600,000 liters, and we only got 89, 90,000 right now, so it'll hold out. I just want to get a, a grand total here. It's almost done and boom we gotta pull my truck up out of the way all right grand total is 103,249 liters of corn and what is the best price for corn 426 boat unloading station 2 is going up so 426 we gotta beat that um go to my other menu here at least we got done before the rain let's see here gonna be all the way over here doo, doo, doo. looks like maybe 412 is gonna be about the average we'll give it a couple more days and see what winter looks like for corn might have still in the spring I, I don't know for sure but anyway kill that Go over here, as y'all saw on that one menu, the pigs need some food. Um, there are baby pigs need some food. We got 40, uh, 65 sheep. We're up 81 chickens, of course gold. Uh, still nine cows and zero horses. So uh, let's go ahead and give them a bag. They took that bag, how much more they need? Okay, I'm not going to give them another bag because they'll be over full. So, okay. we got three bags of pig food left there. And then, of course, we got a lot over here, folks. 22,000 liters. There's 22 of these uh, crates. And each one of them is 1,000. It's a lot of pig food. But I have a feeling we're going to need it but folks, I appreciate y'all coming out and watching me or sitting, watching, whatever y'all doing. When y'all watch me, I appreciate it. I really do. I uh, uh, got a couple of new ones there and I uh, appreciate y'all joining the, the Blue family. And, uh, oh, I always fall off the bridge. I was going to check these greenhouses. We're probably going to do this in the next episode. It is 65% zero manure. Um... Yeah, the lovely lady that takes care of this flyers said she needs some manure because she's running low. 
only got like a bag or two inside left so we're gonna have to give her some manure but anyway i really appreciate y'all i love each and every one of y'all and folks check out the links down below in the description we have a bunch of youtubers down there that's been very supportive of me and there's a bunch of more that i don't have in the list that needs to be in the list but uh, I just ain't had time to do it yet, and because uh, I've been busy. But anyway, uh, I'm gonna get off here, quit rambling. I'm just kind of looking around and see what I really need to do next. Let's just get that field plowed. So, uh, yeah, y'all have a great day, a blessed day. Thank you for your support, and I'm out of here. Till next time, folks. All right. Bye, folks. I know it's a game.